Hi everyone, it's Damien from your spreadsheets. Today we're going to look at how to activate a single user license spreadsheet. After you purchase the single user license for one of the spreadsheets, you will be redirected to this web page. You will also receive an email from your spreadsheets with this web link. Follow instructions on the left hand side. Start by downloading the spreadsheet to obtain your computer's identification number. The spreadsheet is now saved on your computer. Let's open it. Note that I'm using Excel 2019 for this tutorial. All the required steps are explained in this spreadsheet, but I will now walk you through these. When you download a spreadsheet from the internet, the first time you open it, Excel will by default open it in the protected view, so click the Enable Editing button. If your Excel settings are set to block all macros, which is the default, then you will see this notification. To obtain your computer's identification number and to run single user license spreadsheets, you must enable macros. This is not required for company license spreadsheets as these don't require activation. To enable macros, click the Enable Content button. Simple. However, you will have to do this every time you open a single user license spreadsheet. To avoid this, you can enable macros permanently. Click the File button, click Options, next click Trust Center and Trust Center Settings button. Finally, click Macros Settings. Here, select the option to enable all macros. This is only recommended if you use spreadsheet from a known source, like your spreadsheets. After you enable content, you will see your computer's identification number here. This is a unique number that represents your computer only. It is generated based on your hard drive serial number. Therefore, make sure you use the identification number of the computer you want to use the purchase spreadsheet on. Now, copy your identification number and submit the activation key request form. The quickest way to do this is to go back to the web page and click this link. You could also click the Contact Me activation menu button here and then this link. The activation key request form will open in a new window. Fill in your details and paste your identification number. Enter the email address you want the activation key to be sent to. If you provided a different email address during checkout, then enter it in the next field. Now, select the spreadsheet you purchased license for. If you purchased multiple licenses, then you can still submit just one request. I recommend you subscribe to the newsletter. These are very occasional emails where you will be notified if an updated version of your spreadsheet is available. Now, click the Send Activation Key Request button. Within one day, you will receive an email with your activation key and a web link to download your purchase spreadsheet or spreadsheets. Download and open the purchase spreadsheets. Click the Enable Editing button. You will only need to do this once for each downloaded spreadsheet. Now click Enable Content button unless you have already enabled macros permanently as described before. Click the Activate this spreadsheet button and copy and paste the received activation key. Click the OK button. The spreadsheet has been activated and a new tab will appear. Click it to see the main worksheet. Before you start your design, change the company name in the spreadsheet header. Also change the logo. You do this by right-clicking your spreadsheet's logo and clicking Change Picture. Now save the customized spreadsheet and use it as a template. And that is it. The spreadsheet has been activated and is ready for use. Thanks for watching.